talking about applications of artificial intelligence in robotics. I have three use cases to talk to you about. iRobot, Hanson Robotics, and Boston Dynamics. So talking about iRobot, they are basically building home cleaning and lifestyle devices. And one of their most prominent, prominent devices is Roomba, which is a robotic vacuum cleaner. It maps and adapts to the environment and cleans small dust particles or debris in your floor. It is able to determine the room size. It is able to adjust if it's a carpet or a hardwood floor, and it is able to adapt and optimize the routes in your house. It'll also be able to memorize some of the objects which has been kept in the house. So if you see, it's steadily learning and adapting to different environments. And that's where is a very fascinating application of artificial intelligence. The second use case I'll be talking about is from Hanson Robotics. They have been creating human-like robots. So these are not just human-looking robots, but they have eye contact with you and they have facial recognition, speech, and also ability to hold natural conversations with humans. They are also using a proprietary nanotechnology called uh, Frubber, which is a skin that they, they've been using on their robots. And with this, they have been able to program their robots to have human-like facial expressions, which is very realistic. So one of their uh, very known robot is Sophia, which you would have seen in different news, conferences, or discussion panels. Sophia, can you tell me a joke? Sure. What cheese can never be yours? What cheese can never be mine? I don't know. Nacho cheese. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's good, yeah. That's not... uh, I, like, I like nacho cheese. Nacho cheeses. Ew. Gosh, you did, ew. Uh, I'm getting laughs. Yeah. Maybe I should host the show. Okay, all right. <laughs> The third use case is coming from Boston Dynamics. They have been building dynamic, intelligent, and adaptive robots. Most of them you have been seeing on uh, these cool videos coming from them. Uh, one of the latest, latest one was this dancing dog-like robot, which was pretty cool. Uh, they have been using a lot of sensor controls and using the sensor data to uh, train their machine learning models and make the robot act in a certain way. If you are a Netflix fan and have watched uh, Black Mirror, you would have seen in uh, season four, there is a episode called Metalhead, where they took inspiration from uh, Boston Dynamics spot mini model and created this four-legged killer robot. Pretty fascinating again. So I hope this was helpful and stay tuned to Weekend Musings to hear about more applications of AI in industries.